Hi, this is Nikki, and I'm here to share the messages that I get from Spirit and from all of our higher selves that are all helping each other on this journey to unconditional love. And so this morning's message is all about keeping the faith and the hope and saying, duck you to any fear. Because yesterday's message, last night I did a message when I was driving back home and I'd seen all those white ducks on the road. And let me tell you, white ducks are very unusual to see um, because they're not a normal, you know, in the UK, you don't really often see white ducks. And so to see all of them in the road and I had to stop the car because they were in the road. So I had to stop the car for them. It was just so amazing. And uh, anyway, so then who knew? But as I loaded the video after that, so many people contacted me to say, no way. I was messaging my twin at the time and I was literally saying, I ducking love you. And then other people were saying that they had seen a duck had come and spoken to them, well, not, you know, had been with them and all of these other people seeing ducks yesterday. And so that's why this journey is quite amazing. So what I am going to share, I spoke yesterday about the letter that I had channeled for somebody's child. And um, I heard back from the lady and she said, yes, of course you can share it. So I'm going to share the letter because again, what this will do is it will just make you realize again what we're here to do and why you as twin flames are having these beautiful experiences with your children as well. So I want you to know that you are here for a big purpose. We chose you very carefully and you're part of a rainbow group that are here to bring the rainbow technicolor of light to the planet. The way you do this is to shine bright like a star every day, to always love as if it's your last day on earth. Never be afraid to show or speak your love to people, even when they don't show it you back. You are here to see through people's fears and to melt people's hearts, which you will do everywhere you go. Always remember to be true to you. Follow your rainbow heart and let it shine, shine, shine. We love you. Oh, how amazing is that? So I love that because all of the, all of us that are going to be having our little rainbow children that are going to be spreading light and love around the world, is it just makes me just like so unbelievably happy. And I love it that they say, you know, this is because basically what happens is I just say, OK, what do you want to say? And in this case, it was like, what do you want to tell yourself to help you in your life? And because uh, it's the child's higher self. And so I love, I love it. They say, I want you to know that you are here for a big purpose. We chose you very carefully and you are part of a rainbow group that are here to bring the rainbow technicolor of light to the planet. The way you do this is to shine bright like a star every day, to always love as if it's your last day on earth. Never be afraid to show or speak your love to people, even when they don't show it to you back. You are here to see through people's fears and to melt people's hearts, which you will do everywhere you go. Always remember to be true to you. Follow your rainbow heart and let it shine, shine, shine. We love you. Oh, <laughs> so how gorgeous. Now I heard back from the lady, she said, yes, of course, this letter made me cry. And yes, he said that you can share it. Both of us had a knowing that he was a rainbow child. I'm an indigo, so it makes sense. We are both mediums and share this gift. He is my shining star. We share past lives together and we found our way back to each other through adoption. He's from Taiwan. We so planned this incarnation together. I love it all. Oh, ho, ho. So again, I mean, just more and more and more amazing, amazing stories because, you know, that's why it's so important to say, duck you to any fear, right, and doubt, because I'm telling you, it's so incredible, you know, it's so incredible, this journey, and the more we get involved in it and the more I see happening and through all of these letters, because... 
you know, the letters are so different, you know, people asking messages from their, you know, to be channeled from their higher selves or, you know, what do I do in this particular situation? Not really that, but it's more like, you know, what are my blocks and I've been trying to solve this for ages. What's the block here? And so it's really an amazing thing because, of course, it's so powerful um, to have that. And I love the fact that that was that he's saying that, you know, your job is to melt people's hearts every day and you will everywhere you go. So, yeah, it kind of it's just beautiful. So today's message, I'm going to pick a love letter for today. If you want to have a channeled letter from either your high self or your, you know, any you, your twin's high self, then please do all details that are in the link. Or in this case, this lady picked her son's high self. Then, you know, then all of the details are in the link. It's only ten dollars. Um, and also, if you want to have a healing. Or reading um, I got behind yesterday because I had to have a friend out who was uh, having a difficult time so I couldn't do any yesterday so I'm now running behind so if you have got um, a healing and reading booked then you'll receive it by uh, Monday so you'll receive it over the weekend and then anyone that books in today you'll receive it for um, within a week so amazing 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 so here we go and if you receive if you book a letter then you get it within sort of three three days um unless something goes or unless i have something happen that i can't do them but um, it's normally within three days all right so here we go and the number is 133 and you know why that is amazing? Because 33 is the doorway to romance card in the energy deck that I use. So, I often imagine a world where we can just be together. Where when we meet, we were together from the very beginning, without all of this crazy toing and froing that we've been through. I'm sorry that I keep putting away from you. It's just that I think I won't be able to cope if I get too close and then I lose you. It's a stupid reason, I know, and I keep trying to tell myself to trust. I know deep down that my fear is irrational, that I know I can trust you 100%. It's all in my head, but I'm totally working on me at the moment. I'm working on being in the right mindset to come back to you for good. <gasps> oh, well, that just is so fitting for me personally at the moment. So... Well, all of them are, you know, that's the other thing. The, the, you know, what's also, I've said this before, but what's so lovely about all of these messages channel, channeling and the power of this book, creating all of this magic everywhere, is because it's all of our collective energies that are in this book. And then it's not just that, but it's then all of the collective energies of the people that are reading the book and having that intent. So, because every time you read one of these letters, it's a direct link to that divine collective energy and you're literally raising your vibe. So it's all about raising the vibe. So with every single letter in here, um, there is a healing intent for it. Because if you imagine that this letter was from your twin's higher self, then they want you to read this because it is 